Hello everyone, welcome to Titan Web Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you an exciting feature, the custom domain. With any Titan project, you can configure your own custom domain. Let me show you how you can get this done and what you will get. All right, so we'll head over to the project settings and um, we'll take a look at the tools and we will enable custom domain. I'll show you an already configured one and then I'll take you step by step on how to configure it. There are two ways to configure subdomains. You have um, to configure a custom domain either with subdomain or with your main domain. The configuration is slightly different. In this video, we will focus on the subdomain configuration. All right, so we see two things here we need to do. The first thing is give the domain name that where you want your Titan project to uh, go to. And the second thing is configure your DNS. So um, depending on your provider, you if you use, uh, for instance, uh, WordPress with cPanel, then you will head over to cPanel and add the CNAME values to your, um, to your subdomain. And in order for the SSL certificate to be generated, you will need to configure a CNAME with a challenge as well. All right, so uh, let me show you what we get after we apply this. Whenever we publish the project, you'll see that the URL has changed to my subdomain and I launched the site and everything is running off my subdomain. Um, and this is how you brand it. All right, so let's, uh, let's create a new project real quick. And I'll say, just let's do custom from scratch. <clears throat> and let's just put something in there so we can see what we're doing. Let's put this strip right there perfect and we'll do this one over here perfect all right um let's save it and what i will do now is i'm using cpanel with um, wordpress and what we will do is create a new subdomain so this is my cpanel admin it varies, but technically what we need to do is create a subdomain and what we'll do a sub from scratch and I'll hit create and that will create my subdomain. We'll wait for it to be done and then we'll start configuring the C names. Meanwhile, I'll head over to tools and to our custom domain, we'll enable it. We'll click to configure and I'll put in my subdomain. By now it is finished. So I'm just going to grab it and put it in there. And now I'll take the is subdomain since it is and I'll hit register. And now I get my DNS configurations. So I'll grab the CNAME value. Now I'll head back to my cPanel and I'll head over to zone editor where I can configure my CNAMES and I'll hit manage. And now what I want to do is search for my new subdomain. And I want to make sure that I do not have any A records for it. Otherwise, I will not be able to configure the C name as I like it to happen. So I will get rid of the A records for this subdomain. Now, I'll add a record and I'll select C name. And then I'll say sub from scratch. And now, I'll put in my value that I got from the configuration. So right there, add a record. That's it, we're done. This is all we gotta do. 
And for the SSL, we'll add two new C names. So I'll add a new record, C name. And all we have to do is copy the C name name and put this one in the value. And we'll add the record. And we'll hit apply. And we'll save. And now, once we publish this, it will redirect to your um, custom domain configuration. Just a little note, the, the C name takes a little bit of time to, uh, to refresh, just like we've seen in the message here. So if we'll head back to tools, custom domain, it may take up to 72 hours. It usually happens within a few hours and uh, you're good to go. If we'll head over here right now, we'll probably will not get a, um, <clears throat> the domain configured properly. So we just have to wait a little bit and everything will run um, perfectly, just like we have over here. So I've waited a couple of hours and let's take a look at it. And you will publish. Just make sure you do publish the site, we'll launch it, and we have the SSL certificate, we have the C names configured, everything is running smoothly. And this is how it's done.